Well, visitors will not be able to take a splash at Hamilton Pool during the Memorial Day holiday weekend. Travis County Parks closed down that beautiful watering hole for the foreseeable future, all due to falling rocks out there. KXAN's Caitlin Carmuth spoke with a geolog geologist hired by Travis County to survey the area and all the factors playing into this phenomenon. I would not want to swim or sunbathe up under the lip of that overhang. The February deep freeze is part of what geologist Charles Woodruff says led to the fallen rocks under the Hamilton Pool overhang. And it's not just going to do it once and never do it again. Beneath that receding ledge is a sedimentary rock called shale. It's soft, weak, and can split very easily when water seeps in. This piece is a little, little harder, right? So this one's actually a sandy limestone. Geologists like Woodruff and Brian Hunt can't control the rock falls, but they can research the environment that creates them. Drilling a well over here that's going to be an observation well. That well is at nearby Rymer's Ranch, another Travis County park that shares the same landscape as Hamilton Pool. After that water infiltrates, we can measure the level in the well that is being drilled today, and then we can also measure the water level in the river. UT graduate student Mariel Nelson is part of a research team. She's standing above a popular rock climbing wall in Rymer's Ranch that collapsed in 2019 after a significant amount of rainfall. We're interested in this larger study because we want to know how water moves through the limestone landscape. She specifically studies the role of tree roots and their ability to shape limestone cliffs another piece of the bigger picture. There's a lot of different forces at play here contributing to the rock falls, gravity for instance, but by better understanding the geology of the groundwater systems, it allows them to better understand the risks. Caitlin Carmuth, KXAN News.